please subscribe to our channel. The Lagos State House of Assembly on Tuesday said it said it would include punishment for parents of courtists found guilty of courtism in the amendment of anti courtism law submitted by the state government. The House made the submission during plenary in Lagos after the bill had scaled through the second reading through a voice vote. The news agency of Nigerian NAN reports that the new lead title of the bill submitted by the state government is on law societies and courtesy prohibition bill 2020 the speaker of the house modashiro obasa said the punishment was to further prohibit on lawful societies and courtesy in the state and for other connected purposes parents for courtes found guilty of courtesy in the state might be liable for punishment if the bill for a law to provide for the prohibition of unlawful societies and courtesy in Lagos and for connected purposes is passed. Though we will also differentiate between the types of courtesy in the country so that we won't solve one problem and create another. We need to look at the way and manner weapons are used. The existing law should be seriously looked into, Obasa said. Contributing majority leader of the House, Mr. Sanai Agumbiade Ikorudu One, said that sponsors of courtism could not be captured under the bill. Agumbiade said that some of the court groups had their sponsors. He said there must be a, pro a proof before suspending any student found guilty of courtism, adding that suspending a student weapon without proven guilty was already a punishment there must be a proof before suspension and suspected students should be investigated before suspension why parents of students who engage in any court group should also be liable he, he submitted also contributing mr gola jinusa eti osa too said the bill was presented as if it was a new one saying that it should be an amendment bill Yisau said the scope of the bill should be expanded adding that it falls short of its own intentment according to him courtism is what we need to guide against with the information we are hearing on terrorism in his views Rotimi Olowo explained the courtism was being practiced not only in the school's environment Olowo noted that the bill should not be limited to schools as it's supposed to extend into the society he cited examples of Aye fraternity Aye fraternity eight day celebration held in the constituency which led to destructions of property Olowo alleged that some police officers were even in the court groups saying the bills would need various courts activities in the state in the in the board also mr kennedy joseph argued that the bill was not compressing enough if you see what is going on especially when the covid 19 pandemic started female beggars who sat along the road were impregnated and they gave birth to children who are the people that impregnated them some of the guys did so. I will also support the pro proposition that spirit of those found guilty of courtesy must be punished, he said. Mr. Yinka Ogundimu Agege One said that courtesy was very rampant in primary and secondary schools. Ogundimu said the bill should consider punishment for those found guilty while rehabilitation of the mirror or minor fund belonging to the group should be looked into. He, however, said students in tertiary institutions found guilty of courtesy activities must be prosecuted to serve as a deterrent to others. In his remarks, Mr. Desmond Elliott, representing Surulere 1, said the bill was not robust enough to cater for the larger society in the state. According to him, the bill looks childish to, him, to me. The 
bill is supposed to take care of the orientation for the minus found uh, minus found call people Henny Head reports that other lawmakers took turns to comment on the bill. Obasa therefore committed the bills to the House Committee on Judiciary and was directed to report back to the House in three weeks. This is a very good step taken by uh, the lawmakers in Lagos State. Courtism should not be allowed in the country. Courtism should not be allowed and even parents, parents of students who are found in the act should also be punished so that they will know how to guide their children against such at, uh, uh, attitude uh, or such practice you know it is courtesy that gives birth to bad influences and wicked acts in society robbery uh, killings and all that so courtesy should not be allowed to grow in the country and this is a very good law and a very good bill passed and another part of it that is so you know disheartening is the so-called securities the police and some other officers of the law who are found in this in this court of a thing you know this should be dealt with by the government they should look into how to shovel and separate you know those securities who are not doing the right thing out of the good ones so that we can have peace in this country do let us know your thoughts in the comment box do you think it's okay the way they have set up this you know law to punish even parents alongside or it's not good put your thoughts in the comment box thank you